Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Mass key skill video on changing the subject of a formula where the subject appears on the same side twice. So if we want to make x a subject, that means we want to get x on its own on one side of the equation only. Now if the x appears multiple times, then we have this strategy here. So isolate the subject on one side of the equation. Now, can you see that we've already done that here? Because if we want to make x a subject, all the x terms are on one side of the equation. So we've isolated them on one side of the equation. So we've done that already. And then you factorise the subject out. We'll do that in a second. And then you just divide appropriately. So, we've already done step one because all the x terms on one side. We now need to factorise the subject out. Well, we can see these have a common factor of x. So, if we factorise the x out, what's in our bracket? Well, it's x times what is ax? Well, it's a. x times what is minus 3x? It's minus 3. And then we do step three. We just divide. So, x has been multiplied by a minus 3. So, to get x on its own, we just need to divide both sides by all of that bracket of a minus 3. So the left-hand side, if we divide by a minus 3, it gets rid of the times by a minus 3, leaving x. And the right-hand side, we're dividing that b by a minus 3, so it's b over a minus 3. And we don't need the brackets, by the way, because there's nothing else around that denominator. And that's the final answer. We've got x on its own on one side of the equation. So it's therefore the subject.